my channel and happy Tuesday. It is currently 10.42 and I look a little bit sunburned. I don't am I focused? Am I unfocused? I was not unfocused. But yeah, I look a little bit sun sunburned. <laughs> I look a little bit sunburned or just like I have a tan but it just didn't go well on my face. I look patchy now. That, that's fine, don't worry about it. In the last vlog I was telling you guys how I got a Gymshark package but it didn't arrive and I've actually already worn all of these. So I got two bottoms and three sports bras. One is like a bralette so I guess two sports bras, two bottoms and then a bralette. So yeah. Okay so we're gonna start with the bottoms. Let me, oh my god, put this inside out or... Okay so the first thing I got was these leggings. You have you have like the little Gymshark logo right there, like the little shark guy. These aren't that bad. The only thing is that it kind of rough, like it's a little bit too much in the middle, like right here. So it's, there's excess, um, excess fabric there. So just like, if you don't mind that, then you probably like it. And then it has some detailing. I don't even know if you could see. I think people call it like a waffle. Okay, comparing it to my little lemons, they're not as buttery soft, but they are a little bit thicker than my little lemons. I don't even know. These are buttery soft. I think that's like the one that everyone goes for. I don't know the name for it, but people say like the butter soft ones are like the yoga kind of ones, the ones that you just want to wear out. They're a little bit different. Like these literally feel like they're your different workout, and these look like just feel like they're for lounging around. And they're not. They don't feel like the running ones. So I would get those again. I'll get these again. I'll link down the ones that I got because I don't remember the names of it because I threw away the packaging. The other one that I got, okay, so I didn't really plan on getting this one, but I've noticed that when I was working out, I started chafing in between my thighs and I wanted something that wouldn't make me chafe. So I got some cycling shorts. I wore them already, but I don't know how I feel about them. Maybe it's the, the way I wore it because I wore one of Chris's long shirts and then this. So I kind of felt a little bit tomboyish, but like it's it's not bad. It's just that I, I felt like I didn't have a body. So maybe if I wore this with like a black top, yeah, I'll give this another try. But besides that, they aren't that bad. They're probably like the same as this. Actually, not. the material is a little bit different. This one feels a lot thicker. Than this one and i already said this one feels thicker than the lemon ones i like the like the design on the bottom to make your butt look bigger and then for both of them i got mediums because i got a big lid okay for the sports bras i got like i said i got two of them and then one bralette so i got this one this one is low support and it just has a little bit of detailing right there um you can see that it's on the sides and in the back Oh yeah, and this is how the back is right here. It's like double cross, I guess you could say that. So there's like two here and it like crosses right there. I feel like I like this one the most because it's low support. Like I don't I don't have any boobs, so I have nothing to support. It is a little bit tight for me and I got small for all of them. After a while, it kind of does stretch out a bit and I get used to it. Simple black sports bra with the logo right there. Okay, and the other sports bra that I got I wasn't planning on getting this one. I wanted to get one that all of the YouTubers were getting from Gymshark and they were all getting this color. I couldn't find it. Well, it's not that I couldn't find it. It was sold out and I just really wanted the color and I wanted to match with the bottoms, but those are berry colored and these are like a lavender lilac kind of color. But yeah, these are medium support. This is how the back is. I probably be wearing this one the least out of the three because this one is very very tight on me like when they say medium support they are not joking when it's like supported and then this like little cross thingy here it does go over the other boob and because i don't have any boobs it kind of like cuts off my boob like a little bit tmi but like yeah it cuts off my little my boob i might wear it a lot also right here it comes like right on your neck so probably if it was medium support i would have gotten a medium so it wouldn't be that tight, but I didn't know. I didn't know this was how medium support was gonna be like a lot tighter. I don't know, I've never had their stuff. Okay, last one I got was this one. And I, I believe this is like my all time favorite one because there's literally no support to it. 
which I like. It's a bralette for me, like a literal top. There is actually like a little hole here to put the padding in there if you want padding, but I prefer without the padding. So there's that. The Gymshark logo is right there. This is how the back is. And yeah, this is a really good bralette for everyday wear. You can't, I've also used it for working out. It's not that bad, but yeah, this is a good one. And it's, it's softer than the other two. You know how you wear something for so long and then it starts irritating you? Yeah, this is not gonna do that. That's basically all that I got for Gymshark. I just got six items, six items, five items. And yeah, I'll probably buy more. Most likely just only low support because the medium support was a little bit too tight for me. Oh no, I got something else, where'd it go? I knew I got six items. They call this cycling shorts, but I call these like booty shorts because they're super, super short. The Gymshark logo is on the left side as well as right in the middle of the of the back. The thing with these though, I got these in medium also. These mater This material is like the, it feels buttery soft, but also like bathing suit kind of material without like the double lining, but they rise on you. So if you have a booty, like I do, they're gonna rise a lot and they're gonna give you a kind of like a wedgie and go up to you, up, like very high up where they look like underwear. Just, just know that if you want to get these, go for it. But I kind of wear these only when I have like a very oversized shirt so nobody could see or I'm just not lounging around here. I wouldn't wear these to work out. And that is my Gymshark call. So probably what I'm going to do next is just play Animal Crossing for the next two hours. And then go in the water. I don't know if you could tell. I got a tan. I've been in the water for like the past three days. Like literally the past three days. I've been in there for like hours on end. Yeah, I realized I need to buy some pool stuff because my dad always throws them away after it's like winter. He's like, these are old, I'm gonna throw them away. He doesn't care how expensive they are. So I got two orders. Like I got a, an inflatable volleyball cord that goes right across from my pool. And then I also got a floaty. That's like a, like a, what is it? A turtle? How do I say it? God, it's like Hawaiian. It's like my tattoo. Like this kind of like, it has this all around the, the turtle. I'm sorry, I forgot the name of it, but it's that kind of like look to it, which is pretty cool. Um, and then I realized that my dad kind of threw away all of the lounge chairs for outside. So I bought some little beach chairs. So they said it'll come in within the week. Amazon honestly has not delayed stuff. So I'm pretty sure they're gonna come within the week. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead, play some Animal Crossing, and I'll, sh and I'll come back to you guys when I go in the pool. Hello. Hola. Oh, I said hello. I said hola. Okay. Okay, so what's your game plan, Chris? Huh? What's your game plan? What are you gonna game plan? What are you gonna work out? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna work out my body. <laughs> like what? With weights and stuff. Like what? Um, I'm gonna do legs today. Legs? Yeah, so I'm Just gonna like do what I always do when I do legs. Very detailed. While he's doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and tan with these. Hey. What? I'm gonna go ahead and tan for like a good 10 minutes each side of my body and then jump in the water. And yes, it's a, it's a workout in there, so you know that. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Wow, he got my nose. Nice. Right. I'll, like, I'll let him be because he likes to work out. Not alone, but he likes to work out and be in the zone and have nobody talk to him. I know you're gonna wet it. I could just tell. You want this? Do you want this? Go get it. I wish he was a dog that would just like jump in the water from like the deep end, but he has to go into like a little shallow and then just like slowly get in. I look so weird. 
I try my best not to get my face and just my body. So this will do with my little bun up there. Reality of tanning. 90 degree weather. Very sweaty and very hot. Wait, I want to see. No, don't take it off. Cute. Cute, cute. <laughs> there you go. So what happened? Did, oh, did you want to like tan right here? To like even it out? You sure? Positive? You need to kind of fix that. Just, just saying, just saying. So it's the next day and oh my god do you see this this is from me like tanning yesterday um and i covered myself pretty well so oh. that's not that's not cute i am going to try my best and shave coco and if you don't know coco she hates anything that you have to like touch her and cut stuff like cut her hair shaving her hair we can't take her to petco because she's very aggressive so i'm gonna see how this turns out because i've never shaved her hair my dad does not want to shave her hair it's getting hot and she loves to be outside so i have to shave her hair let's let's see how this goes let's go find her i got a towel i found coco let's see how this turns out she looks like an, she looks like an angel but it's secretly a devil <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calm down. Cannot. No! God damn it, Coco. Stay here, okay? Do not move. Okay, so for people who don't know, Cocker Style Cuts are like short here and long here. But Coco has really fine hair, so it gets tanned pretty damn easily. But we're gonna try and just shave the top part and try to do like a gradient here. I don't know how it's gonna turn out, but we shall see. Do not sit down. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna come back to you guys when I'm done with here because it's gonna be a while. Coco! Let me see you. You look choppy, Coco. But better than my dad does. <laughs> so, I'm very hot. Oh my god. I said I was gonna... Okay, so it... Coco, her hair doesn't look that great, but... Honestly, my dad has done worse. So I think in a week or two when her hair grows out a bit more, I will kind of like fix it and even it out, see how that goes. But yeah, I'm gonna go pick up Chris now because I was supposed to pick him up at 1.30 and then, but then um, doing Coco's hair kind of like pushed it back more. So it's almost two. I didn't realize it was gonna take that long to cut her hair. I realized I haven't put you in this vlog today. You want to say hi? What's up? <laughs> he needs to tan dish porch. Look at that. Look at that line. I didn't bring up the backup shirt because it's still wet from the sweat. Ew, ew, ew. I kind of put my boba in the freezer and made ice cream and now this is what's left. Don't eat second day boba because it's kind of nasty. It's like chunky. 
chunky balls. Let's go. Cool.